Anxiety is growing among people who are planning to travel overseas this summer. Travel experts say if you need a passport or if you need to renew it, you better start now. And uh, passports are taking longer to process due to a spike in demand. Lauren Sambolt has uh, your side with what you need to know. Eduardo Lopez of North Carolina is a seasoned international traveler. Travel to Canada, to Mexico, to Italy, just depending on where we need to go. Though he's familiar with the ins and outs of travel, the wait time to get his passport renewed this year caught him by surprise. He had to drive five and a half hours to a passport agency to get it done in time. So I just needed to expedite it. So if I would have waited, uh, I think it would have been about two months. And I can't have that. <laughs> Brian Ortner with AAA says stories like this are becoming all too common. Blaming a record high demand, the State Department has extended expected passport processing times to 10 to 13 weeks for routine service and 7 to 9 weeks for expedited. That does not include mailing time, which could add a few weeks. Before this level, you could get a passport in four to six weeks or two to four weeks. And things are expected to get worse before getting better. The State Department expects an even greater increase in demand this spring and summer, meaning possibly longer delays. For people planning overseas travel this summer, Ortner offers this advice. I would say start now. Go with that three-month average that, that, that we're seeing right now. Words Lopez takes to heart. He's traveling to Spain with his wife and kids next year, and they're not wasting any time. We're in the process of getting her passport right now and my kids, so we have that by next year. <laughs> On your side in Omaha, Laura Samble, 6 News. Travel experts say make sure your application is filled out correctly or you could face even longer delays.